Hey guys, welcome back for another episode of ARK Survival Evolved from the Crystal Arcade server. I've done a little bit more work off camera, uh, not a whole lot of building really, but uh, I've done a decent amount of taming, um, got maybe half a dozen or so things. I did a little more building over in that area over there, which I'm not quite showing yet. Um, See, I don't think I'm... Oh, there was a little bit of a spoiler. Um, well, not really. Um, I'm just getting a basic shape down. Um, apart from that, I'm really not doing a whole lot. I did decide that I wanted to tame a titanosaur. And I did manage to record a little bit of that. So I'll be putting that in here in a second for you guys. Uh, this was a, a gift from Tubby. Um, I haven't really started using it much yet. I kind of forgot I had it. Um, but I put that down. Uh, let's see, what else? I tamed a few things. Tell you what, let me throw up the Titanosaur footage and I'll, um, once that's done I will come back with you guys and we'll uh, talk about what else I got. I've been preparing getting things ready for taming a Titanosaur. There's a couple of them running around the server. And I would like to get one tamed up. Uh, they all seem to be level 840. So I don't need to be too picky other than the color. Um, honestly, don't remember what all I had uh, in the last video. I don't think I had either of these. This was a gift. Um, not really a gift. It was... Um, um, Orpoli left it at the community center. Uh, free to a good home. So I picked it up, and it's been invaluable. I really, I did not like Griffins at the time, but it was better than the Pteranodon. But I really like this now, so I'm going to be looking for a Prime version. I just picked up this Conflagrant Mammoth to make charcoal, which it looks like she's done a good job of. But yeah, uh, as you can see, uh, we've kind of been gathering up a few things for the tame. I have more darts and arrows are going to be a backup but this thing has over 10 million torpor so yeah, the darts probably aren't going to make much of a dent. But anyways I'm going to go after this thing once it becomes daylight and I'll probably come back with you guys uh, at some point then. Okay, I almost forgot to come back in here. I just started shooting. All I have is a little spino over there. Shouldn't be a problem. And uh, this is not going to be exciting, so I'm just kind of going to take him out and I'll uh, probably just speed this up for you guys. basically halfway. Thought of a name for the guy. Or oh, the girl. I'll uh I'm not gonna tell you though, I'll uh I'll wait until I get it named. The gun reloads, there we go. Or fires. Anyways, just wanted to check back in. Shouldn't be long if the gun fires and reloads. There we go.
Okay, this should be the final three shots. Two. And. She's down. Okay. So, I want to... Over here. And... Knock that one out. Alright, now what are you? You shouldn't be a problem. Okay. The Rex over there. What's an ancient Rex? Oof. I do have my Giga with me. Okay, very quickly and carefully. We're going to do that, do that, do that. We're going to get back on here. Okay. It's going to take a lot of berries. It also says that it can be tamed with a saddle, I think is what it's saying. I'm not really sure. Also, base veggie, but I'm not sure how to get that either. Let's get up in the air. So I don't attract any attention. And this is going to be a little bit. So I'll come back in once it's uh, just about tame. Unless something uh, comes up. golden kibble. Sorry if you can hear my phone. Oh, whoopsie. Oops. Oh well. Alright you guys, that was not a very exciting tame to be honest. Um, but I went ahead and recorded a bit of it anyway. Basically just sat there in one spot shooting it. And that's pretty much it. Um, not that that's very different from how a lot of them go, once you have something to just hover over top of it with. But anyway, I thought I'd lay out everything that I've got here so far. I didn't realize I had so many. I've got 15 different tames right now. Of course, we've got our original, um, the gift from the community center, uh, Vibrant. And I have not been naming as many of them, so I need to work on that. Uh, and then I had Brent Spino, Little Harvey, Miss Misty, a Glacial Turtle, Shalanki, which was a gift from Warpoli, and it is amazing. Um, it was a high-ish level, not, I don't believe it was max level or anything, but um, it was definitely, it's definitely really good uh, for all the metal. This was also a gift from Morpoli. I honestly have not used him yet. I need to play around with him a little bit. Or her, sorry. Uh, this was a free to a good home. Uh, which I believe I mentioned in the previous clip. Uh, and I've been using it quite a bit. Um, got uh, quite a number of levels on that. And I, I, I've, I've changed my mind. I do like the Griffins because they can run on the land really good. Plus, you know, they, they fly and they can carry some stuff. Uh, but this is a regular Griffin. So I wanted to get a Primal Griffin that was a uh, decent level to replace it. Uh, this is my Primal Spino, which apparently is one of the only ones that has even been spotted on the server. And I found it just outside of the community center. And I used this guy girl. Uh, I use her a lot. And uh, I got the health up to 350k, and then I've basically just been pumping melee damage. And it does okay. It does like 22,000 per hit, I think. Uh, this little dude here, I think was a... I, I don't honestly don't remember. I think it was from Tubby. I think either Tubby or Friend. I'm, I'm terrible. I don't remember. 
Um, I, and I wish I'd been recording because I put the 500% speed costume on this thing and uh, took off with it and it shot off the edge of the cliff over there and uh, had to do the old jump off before you land trick. And uh, that was pretty amusing. So I wish I had been recording that, but um, yeah, that happens. Then I decided I wanted a froggy. And actually, Tubby found this one and swung by with it, and I knocked it out and tamed it. And I've been basically pumping crafting speed in it, and it is an amazing uh, mortar and pestle. So that's pretty cool. And while I had this guy out leveling it, I found this. I was actually trying to just kill it, but I knocked it out, and I was like, hey, you know what? I think they make gas and some other stuff out their uh, area back here. So I went ahead and tamed it, put it in a ball, and then, uh, let's see, while I was out with my Spino, Warpoli came by, and we were uh, killing an ancient Rex, and he popped one of these out of a ball, and it was doing like 90,000 damage per hit, and I was like, oh man, I've got to get one of these Glacial Gigas. So I went out and found one. Uh, I wasn't thinking about it. I could have recorded it. Honestly, it, it was basically the same as the Titanosaur tame. I found it, went out, and just hovered above it and shot it until it was down. So honestly, that was pretty much it. Um, I would probably like another one, I think. So I'll take you with me on that one whenever I get around to that. But it's doing like 95,000 damage per hit, I think. Um, Real-world damage, not on the dummy, because the dummy always shows more. Um, but yeah, melee damage is almost 8,000, which it's not going to get any higher, because I maxed it last night. Um, so yeah, um, I'm pretty happy with the stats on that guy. The Conflagrant Mammoth, which I got yesterday, just kind of in passing. Ooh, put some more crafting speed on here. Uh, this is our Charcoal. Charcoal burner. That's basically all I'm getting this guy for. And then I've got two other tames in my hotbar. I have got my Titanosaur, which is, uh, I didn't mean to spoil the name. Um, I named it The Big Green. Uh, that was a movie back like in the 90s. Um, like a soccer movie, kind of. And uh, it just made me think of it. And I thought it was funny. And this which I actually had no idea that I had. And apparently, Tubby dropped it off. I'm assuming it was Tubby. Because I think in the stats, uh, while it was in the ball, let me pack it back up here. It says... Oh, well. Okay, it did say... It did say that Tubby had tamed it. For some reason, whenever you put it in the ball, apparently it makes you the one that tamed it. So, okay, maybe it was from Alara? I'm, I honestly don't know. I know Alara had been um, breeding these, I believe. But this is awesome. I'm guessing there have not been any levels put on it. I don't know that for sure. This is awesome. I'm guessing it was a reject since it's labeled nope. But this is really cool because these guys can evidently pick up anything that is able to be picked up. Let's kind of see. Will you pick up a spino? Oh, no. Oh, you picked up Harvey. Will you pick up a spino? No, you picked up a turtle from way far away. Okay. Well, we'll have to play with that a little bit later. And I'll also have to see how much damage it's doing. Uh, I'm going to pack these guys back up, and then we're going to go down to the beach, and I'll show you the Titanosaur. So give me just a minute, and I'll be back with you guys. Okay, I've uh, put, I put everything away. Tongue-tied there for a second. Uh, balled all the dinos back up. I made a speed costume for this guy. Or girl. Is it a girl? girl feels about right 
pretty close to the other one. Let's head on down. Ooh, bog. Let's find the community center. Wherever it is. I think it's over there. Is it over here? It's somewhere. I think this might not be it. Is, oh, there it is over there. Need to get rid of this fog. I don't know why they thought this was a good idea just to make everything... Oh, okay. I think somebody already got it. Yeah, that or it just went away on its own. But just in case, I'm going to go ahead and mess with this glass dodo here. Yeah, there we go. Happy dodo. Okay. Okay. Let's see if there's anything going on over here first. There's my hobo camp. Nope, everything looks pretty much the same. Uh, maybe a few more miscellaneous dinos, but no additional builds or anything. Okay, so let's first off take a look at the damage for this guy. Okay, so 5,400. Get rid of you because you're going to be a problem. Oh, that did 10,000. Okay. Uh, health is 213,000. Let's put one point into there. Oh, we got a... We got a dodo. Okay. Uh, melee damage, 5,500. 5,700. Thought I heard some. Okay, I would like... I like the health to be higher than that. Okay. Let's maybe do that. Let's put a bunch of points into mailing. Let me get to 10,000. Okay, let's see what that does. Okay, that does 20,000 ish. Let's do that. Okay, you're doing 22,000 per hit. Let's get a few more levels. Hopefully, come on, get out of here. Okay, get you. Just gonna run around here. Let's see if we can find one of those, well, turtles for one thing. Uh, um, beach turtles, not in the water turtles. Uh, but also, here's a Bronto. Those uh, miniature titanosaurs would probably be good. So let's uh, let's do a little speedy up bit here. Here's one, and uh, let's get some levels. looped around we're back at the community center let's maybe head inland a little bit more
All right, you guys. I'm going to continue to do a little more leveling. And not sure how long this video is running. I should probably see where the speedy up bits land um, before I record too many more clips. So I'm going to kill some more stuff, get a few more levels, um, see where we're at as far as time, and then I'll get back with you guys again. Alright, I totally forgot, got busy leveling uh, my new griffin. I totally forgot about this guy, the big green. Now, pocket levels he's already got, she has already got quite a few, but I just want to see what the base stat is here. So we're doing 33, oh it gathers meat. Does it eat meat? I don't know. That's a good question. Uh, okay. So we've got 600,000 health. Okay, we finally managed to get that Reaper taken down. Uh, well, I, I didn't do it, actually. I was running away to get my Giga out. And uh, Dean pulled his out, and he, he got it taken care of. Oh, it looks like he might be fighting that uh, Titanosaur over there now. But, um, yeah, with the damage reduction those guys take, this just was not cutting it, only doing 1,700 per hit. Um, honestly, this is really tanky well, for most things. That thing took me out really fast. Um, but I'm just not sure how good it's going to be. Let's pump some more levels into here. And I want that health higher. That was what we got, 700,000 health now. Let's see what kind of damage we're doing now. Actually... Let's head back this way. Surely there's not another Reaper. Actually, I could just hit anything, really. Let's hit these guys. 45,000 per hit. That is much better. Much, much better. Why am I bleeding? Ooh. <sighs> Stupid Pego. Let's take out this. Take out that. 
Oh, somebody took out that. Oh, it was him. Okay. Let's kind of head uphill here. Oh, it's just the. Oh, my God. I forgot I was recording for a second here. Okay, well, this is an Ancient Rex fight. Um, no idea where its health is. I know it has 3 million health. It's not actually able to touch me right now, so as long as we didn't run out of stamina, we could just go ahead and do this until it dies, so that's good. Speed this up for you guys. All right, that gave us three more instant golden kibbles. I've got quite a few of those now, close to 20, I think. Okay, now for real, I'm going to probably go back to base, uh, cut this footage together and see where we're at. I have a feeling that we're uh, pretty far up there. So yeah, let me check on that for you guys. All right, you guys, I've just been kind of messing around here, uh, putting some stuff away, making some more cementing paste, all that good stuff. I think that's probably going to be all we have time for in this episode. Looks like it's going to run about a half an hour, and there's a Discord notification again. Um, but yeah, I'm happy with the, uh, the dinos that we've got so far. I've got an idea of what I'm doing over there for that build. So things are progressing. And I'm having a really good time playing on here with everybody. So, everybody who has uh, gifted me things, thank you very much. And uh, I, I, I don't take as many risks as some of the people on here do. Um, so I end up not getting my own stuff a lot of times until later game. So, anyways, if you like this episode, go ahead and hit the like button. Subscribe if you haven't already. And I'll see you guys in the next episode.